Alright YouTubers, welcome back to War Thunder with the Angry Nerd. Today we will be looking at the BF109E versions. They are the first uh, BF109s that you can reach in the German tree. They are directly below the HE112s. It is a double tab and when you click it you get your two BF109s, the E1 and the E3. Let's take a quick look at the difference between the two planes. And the major difference is in the firepower. The BF 109E1 is a rank 2 with a battle rating of 2.7, has a max speed of 366 miles per hour, a 19 second turn time, and it comes equipped with four 7.92 millimeter machine guns and that is two in the cowling above the engine and one in each wing. For me, this is not enough firepower in tier two to bring down the enemy aircraft in a timely manner. And what ends up happening, for me at least, is I get a lot of kill assist in this aircraft because I'm not killing the planes fast enough to get the kills all by myself. So I start the engagement and just not bringing them down I have to make a second pass or something and by that time um, somebody else has put some rounds in it and I get a kill assist. But in the BF 109E3 edition or variant it's a rank 2 with a battle rating of 3, max speed at 367 miles per hour, 18.9 second turn time, comes equipped with two 7.92 millimeter machine guns in the cowling above the engine, but right here, one in each wing is a 20 millimeter MG FF cannon, two of them one in each wing and the addition of those two cannons in this aircraft make it a formidable foe. It is what I like to use because of the cannons I can bring down uh, enemy aircraft um, I wouldn't say relatively quickly but before somebody else gets over to help me with it. So you know, that way I get the kill and not the assist. Now this 109E1 uh, version, you know, I do have to say that I would much rather use this the HE112 BO rather than the BF 109E1. I'm just, I mean, flight characteristics, everything is the same, just not quite enough firepower for me for tier two. Now, this is the standard camouflage pattern for the E1. There are no other patterns available at this time for this aircraft. However, the BF 109E3 does have some different patterns and here is the second one and the third one now you can unlock these patterns through achievements in the game or you can pay some money to unlock them if you don't like the standard so here we are BF 109, E3, and E1. Let's jump in the game and see what we can do with these birds. Hopefully we'll get a good map this time. Mo's dog. I don't think I've ever seen this map. 
Hmm. It's a domination with two airfields and some vehicles. So, yeah, the, the 109E is about useless. I have to go in with the E3. Or the E1 is about useless, so. Oh, I know what this map is. Guess I just didn't know what the name of it was. It spitfire is a lot lower. I'm not totally ignoring it. It could come up from the bottom and get me. It's happened to me before. But, uh... It's kind of looking at this F4F. That noise you hear in the background is... Oh, shoot! My cat. Four, three, two, one. So, I'm just running around trying to pick off some targets. Reload. Regain some altitude. Cannons back up. This P-26 is coming down here, but I don't know how long he'll last. He 
might last long enough for me to get down here. And he did. Somebody's on me, so I'm going to break off of the Buford. You got to know when to give up the chase. Now, if you're not trying to keep your aircraft for a while, doesn't matter, but I like to try to keep mine as long as I can. Okay, this F4F is out from his pack a little bit. Took some damage out of that. IL-2 and a P-40 and a Buford. engine was going dead so I wanted to come over now it's completely black I got somebody coming in oh, I thought I had somebody coming in behind me but evidently not I gotta put her down she's gonna give completely out on me Hopefully I'll get repaired before I get taken out. Oh, this doesn't look good. Does not look good at all. Direct flight path right over the top of me. Two seconds, one, I might have made it. Okay, so we survived. And we may, let's see. Still got to gain some altitude. Spent way too much time sitting on the runway.
Okay. What is this? Alright, I got a new camouflage pattern. I can get rid of that ugly old yellow one. So I showed it to you before. Let's go ahead and save this. So we will go and, well, let's see. We got 23,506. <clears throat> we got a total of 2,938 vehicle research, 9,948 modification research. What we got for a premium was uh, 8,031 lions. 4,974 modification research and 1,493 that's the extra that I got for having a premium account and bonus for the first victory with this country player stats came in third the game I got that sixth kill but in my stats only got five so cause the game ended so, let's see, let's go right here into the camouflage. That looks much, much nicer. I like it. Very, very nice. So we'll do this in a minute. New camouflage pattern. And so if you like the video, like it. If you didn't, don't. If you know anybody who might like it, let them know about the channel. Um, subscribe if you would. And as always, thanks for watching. Nerd out.